All right, so Mario Kart. I own this game on the SNES, and I loved it. Even though the game cheats, it literally cheats at high levels. When you go to the harder courses, the, the, the opponents you're fighting will have infinite items and infinite stars, which is really broken. But this was the game that started it all. This was the game that started the racing craze with licensed characters. So not only did you have so many Mario Kart games later on, you had Sonic racing games and Crash racing games. This was the game that started the craze, okay? Um, I love this game, but it's very difficult. And I know I'm probably going to suck horribly at it because I haven't played it in a long-ass time. So let's see how this goes. Mario Kart. By the way, I may play this for a while today because I really like this game and I want to get better at it. So, if you play 100cc class, you unlock more. I'm going to try it, but I'm probably going to get owned. Watch, I'm probably going to do terrible. So, Yoshi was always my character. I always picked Yoshi. We're definitely starting with Mushroom Cup. Let's see if I can even remember how to play. I couldn't remember the speed boost. Oh my god, I gotta remember the controls. Oh boy. Oh my god, I'm doing so I can't remember how to play. Okay, I'm starting to remember now. I love the music, the classic music. Got her. The courses are so short, too. There are longer ones, but this is the shortest one in the game, I think. I gotta remember how to power slide properly. Oh, banana. Oh, man! See, that's the problem. The enemies will have infinite amounts of their, their own items. They all have custom items that they use. So they can cheat. They can literally cheat. Every single race, they have infinite items. Oh, nice. That's going to help. Got him. Take that, Koopa Troopa. I did it. I got first. Woo! That's right. So in this game, you can power slide, but when you power slide, you lose control. So it's about hopping. You use a hop instead of a power slide to get around the tough corners. And there's actually shortcuts and stuff you can do by hopping over stuff, if I remember correctly. All right, Shell Con Artist just tipped me $6. And he says, hey, Phil, how's it going? I think I've played virtual NES and SNES on my Switch more than the actual Switch games. I'm not surprised. I'm honestly not surprised. These games are amazing classics, dude. Seriously. Thank you, Shao Kahn Artist, for the big, biggest tip of the day so far. <clears throat> I also love this game, so I would play the hell out of this game if you guys wanted to see me play. I would love playing Mario Kart and getting better at it. I love the courses, too. The courses are, like, really fun. In this one, Rainbow Road is so hard, but it's fun as hell. The music is so iconic. All right, so I got first. All right, let's continue. Feather and Mushroom with the best escape weapons. Dude, the Feather is so good in this game. Uh, I gotta remember the speed boost timing. Oh, crap. I already screwed up. La, la. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. Oh, I love this music, dude. I grew up listening to this music, seriously. Oh, God, I lost control. Oh, man. Oh, here comes the illegal. I told you, the illegal banana peel. He doesn't have that. The game just gives it to him infinitely. He'll keep getting those. He doesn't actually have it. He didn't pick it up. He just fucking gets it for no reason. Here it is. See, I told you. It's bullshit. The game cheats. Oh, what? A random shell out of nowhere literally appears. There you go, Koopa Troopa. He has his infinite shells. Oh, I'm screwed now. I'm probably not going to come back. Oh, my God. I can't get out of the freaking side of the thing, dude. 
What? Another random shell appears out of nowhere and hits me. What? Did you see that? Did you see Bowser jump over the item? Yeah, he doesn't have the ability to do that. You can't just jump out of nowhere. <laughs> and we're only on 100cc. On 150cc, and you know, the harder difficulties, the game really cheats badly. Alright, I may be able to catch up with Kuma, but I don't think I'm catching up with, uh, with Donkey Kong here. Nah, no way. Yeah, second. Dude, the game cheats so bad. So every enemy has infinite items that they can throw behind them, and then they can jump over items too for no reason. It's like, huh? How's that fair? So now we're tied. Yeah, we're tied for first. Okay. Oh, ghost house. Still don't remember the speed boost. Oh, great. Well, so much for the speed boost there. If you have a flower or a feather, you could do the shortcut right there. Oh my god, I suck. I hit someone with the shell. Boom, boom. Oh, nice. I'm going to take the shortcut. I have the feather now. Sure can get you way ahead. Here we go. Look at that. Huge shortcut. Amazing. I got another one. Oh my god. I'm lapping the I'm lapping the people in last. Fuck off! Now you're even further behind. Well, no one's catching up to me on this one. A double shortcut run. Amazing first place. <laughs> That's how you smash it right there. Holy shit, dude. Smash it. Mm -mm. And every character has their own individual victory music when you win a race in this. It's awesome. Ponage 101, I absolutely would attempt a 150cc run if I unlock it. I mastered this game back in the day. I'm terrible at it now, obviously. But I'll get better at it the more I play it. I love Mario Kart. See, I like this game way better than F-Zero. Seriously, F-Zero to me is so boring compared to this. This is fun. Get to see all the individual stages, the fun music items, the cheating. <laughs> okay. Bowser stage. Still didn't get the speed boost. I gotta learn the timing for the speed boost again. Cause that's key to winning races, getting that starting speed boost. Right, I got the feather. That's gonna help me jump over uh, obstacles in this stage. Yeah, look out. The first, uh, first go around, the thwomps don't come down. Second and third, they do. And they really fuck up your game. I may just hold on to the feather. Yeah, I may just hold on to the feather. Oh my god. Because that way, if someone throws an item right in front of me, or if the item in front of me, I can jump over it. If a thump, if a thump steps on you, you get completely screwed over. You get so far behind if a thump lands on you. Oh my god, what? That was close. Okay. Not four. I love this music. 
It's a variation of Bowser's theme song from Super Mario World. His boss theme. Alright. Well, quite frankly, I'm happy I chose 100cc. If I had chosen uh, 50, it probably would have been too easy. Oh my god! Hit the swamp twice. That's not good. Out of my way, Luigi. Alright, I got it. I got first. Woohoo! So that's mushroom cups. It's easy. They get harder the further cups you go in. And once you unlock 150cc, then it gets really tough. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Ding, ding, ding. Yeah, Luigi's sucking the balls. Luigi getting lapped. <laughs> do I like Mario Kart 8? I do. I like all the Mario Karts. But this is the one that I grew up playing. So I know the stages. Like, I know everything about the game. I love it. All right, well, that was easy. That was easy. Oh, we're not done? I forgot there's five courses. Holy shit, I totally forgot. Still didn't get the boost. I can't remember the timing. Banana. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. I love this music so much. I said I grew up playing this game. It's total nostalgia trip. Oh my god, what the? I got stuck completely. Alright, I gotta try to. What I gotta try to do is hit Donkey Kong right in the ass with this green shell. Oh, you got away, you son of a bitch. What, the, dude? This is what happens with this game. They cheat like crazy. They absolutely cheat. They'll push you into a freaking pipe and you can't move. La 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 la. La 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 la. Here comes. The banana he shouldn't have, because he just threw one. But the game cheats blatantly. He also just got an artificial speed boost for no reason. Yeah, look at that. He got a speed boost for no freaking reason. He jumped over a banana, which you can't do. Well, I still beat him. Woo! Despite his blatant cheating, I still won. Good stuff. All right, and a spamming moron just got banned. Mm -mm. He's like, oh, I dropped a banana peel, then I throw a banana peel, then I jump over a banana peel. What the fuck? So how'd you have three items? <laughs> All right, a rousing first place win right there. Of course, this is the easiest stages. Oh, here we go. The golden trophy for, for Yoshi. And then he accidentally kills the flying chief chief. Yeah. All right, take the gold. Great race. Jack is first up. If I got a second pet, would I get another cat or something like a dog? I have no idea, but we don't want a second pet. We're happy with our, our, our one pet, Jasper. Moonwalker says, why do the old games sometimes blatantly cheat? I mean, can't really answer that. So what I have to do, I have to beat every every one of the race classes as 100 CCs. And once you do, you unlock the 150 CC, which is the actual true speed class. But we have to do all these races first. Let's do Flower Cup. Yeah, Regal X7 says, I recently played this and Luigi was perpetually using stars. It's total bullshit. Yes, when you're on 150cc, every single character has infinite items and cheats constantly. They do super jumps, they use infinite stars. It's complete horse shit. Magnum Wonder, this is the game I'm most hyped for in the collection. He's like, what are you most hyped for in this collection? This game right now. Still didn't get the boost. I can't figure it out. Damn it. Yeah, this Choco Cup or Choco World. You have to hop over the chocolate. If you don't, you slow down dramatically. 
la 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 Look at that, I jumped over it to speed up. So this time it looks like Koopa will be my main uh, competition, because he's in first, see that? Koopa Troopa. Banana. I love that whistle. Do, 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 do. This is actually the easiest Choco Cup. There's a really hard one. We have to drive straight through chocolate for a long time. You have to hop the whole time. What? Oh, God. You saw what happened? I used a speed boost, but I did it into the dirt, so I lost my speed boost. It didn't even count. Here we go. I'll hold on to it just in case. So in original Mario Kart, there is no blue shell. There's no lightning. All those things were added much later. Much later. So if you're in first, as long as you have an item in your inventory, like a banana peel or a green shell, what you can do is hold that item behind you. And if you hear a shell coming, you could stop it. So if someone has a red shell and shoots it, you could hold the item behind you and it defends your butt. And then they can't hit you. So in this game, you could actually hold first as long as the computer isn't cheating and using infinite stars and stuff. Opponent says, I think it's just before the light goes green. Oh, yeah? Okay. <clears throat> no, E. Honda, I don't think there's lightning in this one. Is there? Oh, wait, you might be right. There might actually be lightning in this one, but it's super rare. Still didn't get the boost. I tried it right before it went green. It's, like, super rare to get the lightning, I believe. Like, so rare that I don't even remember that it's in the game. It's very hard to get. So on this stage, if you have the feather, you can jump over the holes. I fucked up bad right there. Yeah, I did. I'm done. I'm never gonna catch up now. That's it. Once you get, once you get fucked like that, you're done, dude. You saw what I did? I jumped over it. What? Did I use the shell? I used. I used the shell to try to stop the fucking uh, banana and it didn't work. It went through the banana and didn't affect it. That's bullshit. I got robbed. Well, I'm going to get terrible ranking. Now there's nothing I can do. Oh my god. Maybe maybe I do have something I can do. Hold on. Let me get to it straight away. The fireball is bullshit because the fireball moves. It is complete nonsense. Well, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be second. I got robbed. At least I caught, caught up the second, but still, that was bullshit. <clears throat> yeah. So some of the items are so broken. First of all, fireball. Why does anyone have a fireball? You can't use a fireball in this game. Well, Bowser has a fireball, and when he uses it, it, it moves. So it makes it hard to dodge. All right. Second is better than six, says Cinder Fall, fall from RWBY. I agree with you. Doggy Smurf last night went fine. Thank you for asking. I talked about it on pre-stream. Okay. Still no speed boost. I can't figure it out. You know, I used to be able to do it. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, no! The mole got stuck to my face. You have to keep jumping in order to get it off your face once it's on your face. What it is, it could screw up your steering. It makes you steer the wrong direction. Oh my god. And by the way, the computer never gets affected by the moles. The computer completely ignores them like they're not even there. La, 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 Essentially, all the road hazards are just there for you. The computer does not give a damn about your road hazards. It's like, I don't know what you're talking about. It's like, I, don't, I just want to race. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> okay. 
La 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 la. La 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 la. I slowed down. Shit. Watch as he expertly dodges the shell he can't see. I love that. I have a better speed than Kuba, but Kuba has better handling. So as long as I stay on the straightaways, I'm okay. There we go. Alright, final lap. Another shell. So far ahead he threw it? That's impossible. You can't throw items that far ahead in this game. The computer doesn't give a crap. It's like, I'll do whatever I want. Made it. Woo! It's all about cutting the corners. Look, he was right on my ass, too. But it's all about cutting the corners. <clears throat> Kuba was right on my ass. Handicap Gaming ER, it's good to see you back from your surgery. I hope you're feeling better. Yes. Da, 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 da. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Drift turns. See, drift turns in this game are not good shopping curve. When you drift, you actually lose control of your vehicle most of the time. Instead, you're supposed to hop and adjust your turn mid-air. And when you land, drive normally, then hop again. It's about multiple hops, not about drifting. It was actually Mario Kart 64 where they added drifting and drift boosting. In this one, you don't have it. Still didn't get it. Elite Shadow Ninja says, I'm glad you're having fun with this game. Thank you, Elite Shadow Ninja. I love this game. I'll play this whole game from start to finish if you guys want. Seriously, like, I love it. So I forget what the ideal route is on this map. There is an ideal route. But I can't remember which one it is. This map gets very, very tough when the thwomps land in front of you. So this next one is going to be tough. When the thwomps start coming down, it's a pain in the ass. Oh, God. See? A oh, pain in the ass. Got him! Perfect. I jumped over the thwomp to save my ass there, but now I hit some stuff, so I'm screwed. They're gonna be right behind me. If you, like I said, if you get stomped on by a thwomp, you're, you're done. Your race is essentially over. It takes you so long to get back on the course after being flattened that there's no point in even racing anyway. Just give up. All right, it's a five lapper. And by the way, you cannot kill a thwomp unless you have a star. If you have a star, you could go through the thwomp outside of that. None of the items affect the thwomp. They bounce right off the fucking thing. Look, I just got completely screwed. Oh, man, the thwomps are pain in the ass. Oh, I hit a Koopa. He's back. I got him. I hit the Koopa with a, with a backward shell. That was awesome. Now I just gotta maintain first. I got screwed. They're gonna catch up now. Did I do it? I did it. Nice. Woo! He was right on my ass again. You saw that? He was right on my ass again. Yeah. Boom, boom. <laughs> Cinder Fall says, Kuba was put through living shell. It's a shell pun. Suck of surprises, you're surprisingly knowledgeable about this Mario Kart. I told you I owned it and I played the living shit out of this game. I mastered it. I beat everything on the hardest difficulty and everything. So... Ducky Spruce says Koopa is the most underrated Mario Kart character. He's all around, like, he's he's good, but not great. Meaning he's good at everything. He's good at handling, decent speed. Well, Yoshi's really good at speed, but not good handling. <clears throat> it's 
still didn't get the speed boost. It's gonna take me all day to figure this out. Got someone with that. So the oil slicks will screw you up. I think they slow you down and you lose control of your cart. So you have to avoid the oil slicks or you get screwed. It was on my ass. I missed the speed boost. That sucks. So there you go with the impossible placement of the shell that's not possible to actually do in the real game. What's funny is, this is only 100cc and you see how crazy good the computer is driving, right? Can you imagine on the next highest difficulty how hard it gets? Because it gets fucking real hard. And this is only the second hardest difficulty. 150 is like, oh, fuck me. Then you got the reverse tracks. After you beat 150, you get reverse tracks. That's even harder. All right, fuck this guy. Watch this. Now that was completely unfair. There was nothing I could do. He went perfectly in front of me. I tried to get out of the way. He was still perfectly in front of me. And then he drops the banana peel. I'm like, what do you want me to do? There's nothing I can do about that, dude. Now why is Koopa speeding up, right? Why the hell did Koopa just get that speed boost? It makes no sense. He got artificial speed boost, rubber banding. What the hell, dude? What the hell? Complete nonsense. Great. Well, I'm gonna get second, but it's alright, because Koopa was the one who I was competing with, and he got third. So I'm still gonna win the circuit. Yeah, Vincent, what happens is, once you beat the game on the hardest difficulty, they, then it has a new, a new stage unlocked where you have to do everything backwards. And yes, that's very tough. Handicap Gaming says, how was my vacation? I wish I had a vacation. <laughs> I did not have a vacation. So there we go, boom. Look at that, way ahead of everybody. All right, so that's Flower Cup. Very nice. Congratulations! Okay. Keep going. You guys are having fun? Keep going, right? So now we're going to see a uh, Star Cup, and then once we do that, it'll unlock Special Cup. Well, I do a playthrough of the Mario and Luigi series, if you guys wanted to see it. I don't know if you guys heard recently, very sad news, the makers of the Mario and Luigi series declared bankruptcy. They're pretty much going out of business, which really stinks, because they were making a new game for the Switch, too. <clears throat> do the coins do anything? If I remember correctly, they make you, don't they have you make a better maximum speed? I can't figure out the boost. All right, the beach stage. This is a pain in the ass. Because every single time you're in the water, you slow down. So you have to hop through it to maintain your speed. Of course the cheap sheep hit me. Of course it did. La, 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 la. La 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 Take that asshole Yeah, I think I think you get better maximum speed With the uh, with the with that I'm, don't don't quote me on that. I could be wrong Oh, great, it made me small. I forgot about this. Dude, am I ever gonna change back? What the hell? Why am I so Dude, I'm never changing. What is this? It took forever to change back. Go, 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 go! First! Yes, that was close. Holy shit, that was close. Dude, I was small for so long. Holy shit. 
dun, 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 dun. Poo -poo. Coins do give some speed? I thought so. I thought the coins sped you up a little bit. Damn. I agree, that was a cliche. <laughs> he was right on my butt. Right on my butt. Alright, so this is Choco Island 2. This is the one where I think you have to drive through the whole, like, river of liquid. God damn it, I have to remember the boost. I still don't know it. Oh no, I already screwed up. Here it is. So if you jump through it like this, you go faster. Yeah. I screwed up again on that turn, man. Damn it. Doggy Kong throwing a hundred bananas. Look. He already threw three in one lap. What the hell? Four. You do four now. Five. You do five fucking bananas. Six. Six bananas in one lap. Seven! Dude, seven bananas? Eight! Nine! Dude, he will not stop. That's ten straight banana peels. Eleven! He finally stopped. Twelve. Twelve banana peels. <laughs> twelve fucking banana peels. Jesus Christ. You can't get twelve items on that state on that map. <clears throat> yeah, you literally had a dozen a dozen bananas eating them and throwing the peels all over the place. <laughs> oh my god. Will I be playing the League of Legends fighting game when it's released? I mean, if, if it's not super expensive, I would check it out. I don't know about League of Legends making a fighting game. What the hell do they know about fighting games? But maybe it'll be good. Who knows? Oh, Ice Stage! Still didn't get it. La 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 la. So this is a tricky stage with a lot of hazards. The ice blocks stop you. You can fall in the water and that stops you. Like there's just a lot going on in this stage. What was I supposed to do? He threw it directly in front of me. There was nowhere to go. Yeah, I'm screwed now. And she jumps over it, which you can't do. Wow, that helped. Holy shit. What a great speed boost that was. The good thing about this stage is once someone breaks an ice block, it doesn't respawn. So once the ice block's gone, you're good. See, I'm in the clear. <laughs> nice. And yes, the snow is bright as fuck. It messes with your eyes. <laughs> you gotta remember, back then we were all playing on CRT TVs. CRT TVs, number one, were not as bright as LCD TVs. So all of us watching on our, you're watching on your devices or your laptop screen, you know, I'm watching on my TV. It's very much more bright than it was back in the day playing this game on a CRT TV. So it hurts our eyes, but back then it was okay. Hello, Transporter. Happy Halloween to you, too. A little early for that, but uh, I'm a very festive guy, so thank you. <laughs> All right, Bowser stage is the second one. This is very tough, if I remember correctly. Still didn't get the fucking boost. I'm gonna remember it. It's gonna take a long time, but I'm gonna remember the goddamn boost. That, this stage you get two items in one go, which is nice. I just screwed up. 
I had the speed boost to hit the wall, completely negated the speed boost. Fuck off. I will keep that red shell till the end if I need to. Oh, till right now. Oh, look, I passed him anyway. It didn't matter. I'll hold on to it, though, like I said. The other thing is, the computer cheats in many different ways. Like, right there, there was one. But the computer will hit a wall and not lose its maximum speed. It will retain its maximum speed. Like, wait, what? Yeah, the computer blatantly cheats a million different ways in this. What? That didn't make any sense at all. Oh, did you see that? They all drove through the swamps and ignored them, but I hit the swamp and it affects me. How is that fair? The good thing is I'm already way ahead in the rankings, so it's not going to affect me too bad even if I do poorly on this stage, but still, it's freaking bullshit. Yeah, I love how they all drive through the thumps and ignore them. I get screwed. Alright, I'm back on Donkey Kong's ass. He's gonna beat me, yep. He has a better maximum speed. I have overall more speed than him, but when he's on maximum speed, he's faster than me. <clears throat> I completely screwed over. But how was that for? They all literally drive right through the swamp like it's not there, but I'm gonna get affected by the swamp and I get screwed. <laughs> it's still okay, I'm still resoundingly in first. So as long as I get first or second here, I, I still win. Final race, Mushroom Cup. Still didn't get it. Yeah, ultimately you want to avoid power sliding in this game. In other Mario Karts, it's a strategy. In this game, it's like, I don't want to do it. It actually makes you lose control of your vehicle, and you lose speed when you do it. In Mario Kart 64, that's exactly what you want to do because it actually gives you handling around corners, and you can get a boost off of it. You can't do that in this game. So, it's a very different. The original one is very different from the future ones. Look at that. Now, Donkey Kong has the worst handling because he's, he's a big character, yet he goes around the corner perfectly. Like, huh? If he was going at that speed around the corner, he should have actually completely lost control. For some reason, the game gives him perfect handling. Right. He jumps over his own fucking banana. Nice. He just keeps getting bananas. Another one. The one fair thing, at least they they play the sound effect and they show the camera when he's throwing them. So at least you know to expect them. But it is complete bullshit that he gets infinite bananas, you know? Here we go again! Why? Why did he get maximum speed around that corner and why does he get to put a banana right in front of me? Completely unfair. I don't even think there's a way to catch up to him now. I think I'm done. Like, I, he's gonna get first, I get second, or third. I'm still gonna win the overall race, but... It's bullshit, the game cheated. Fourth! Fourth! What? Blatant cheating. So I might actually not win now. I might get second. I might have to do the whole circuit over. Because they gave me fourth at last minute for no fucking reason. Yup! I got robbed. If I had gotten second or third, I would have won. Did they rob me? 
That's another thing I told you. When the, when the computer gets touched, it loses no speed. When you get touched, you lose all of your speed. It makes no fucking sense at all. Completely broken. Yoshino Lover resub for 12 months. Thank you, Yoshino Lover, for the resub. I appreciate that. So I got I have to do the whole fucking circuit over again because of that. Because the game cheated at the last minute. That's also correct. If you tie, you lose. If you tie, you don't you're not considered the winner. You're considered a loser. So I gotta do it again because the game cheated. Haha, <laughs> so funny. Oh my god. See, I touch him. He he keeps all his speed. I lose all of mine. What? What the fuck is that? Frankly, I prefer Koopa being in second or first or second, because Koopa isn't as cheap as fucking uh, Donkey Kong or Bowser. Donkey Kong and Bowser are the worst. They completely cheat. They're bu they're bullies. You know, Bow Bowser has the fucking moving fireball. Well, Donkey Kong has the infinite bananas. And because they're the bigger characters, they can bully you around the track, which is fucking stupid. So I'd prefer to have uh, Koopa be the person in first or second that I'm competing with. Oh, you know what? I'm forgetting there's a shortcut to the right there. I just forgot about it. There's a shortcut to the right through the water that gives you an extra item. I completely forgot. There we go. Yeah, there's a shortcut in the water there. You can't see it unless you know about it. <clears throat> Alright. Like I said, against Koopa, this may be way easier. I can't remember how to do it. Well, I fucked up badly. I meant to press shoulder and I pressed item instead. Dun, 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 Oh, I did it again. Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh, I'm getting screwed over. I'm getting completely screwed over. What? What in the holy hell? He wasn't even in front of me. Next thing you know, he teleports in front of me and there's an item hitting me. What? Now I'm getting spun out. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god! Forget it, there's no way I'm catching up. There's no way. Yeah, I'm screwed, man. This is bullshit. <clears throat> That's correct. When you have coins, you'll get slowed down, but you won't spin out completely and get screwed over. If you have no coins and you get hit by anything, you completely spin out and slow down. So you always need to have coins. So now I'm in second, which is fucking bullshit. Nope. I'm trying all different timings and I can't figure it out. There we 
go is fucking infinite bananas. Wow. And then he misses the freaking shell too? Oh, fuck off. See, it's hard, it's hard for characters like Bowser and Donkey Kong to get maximum speed on this stage because this stage is almost all turns and they need to be have straightaways. All right, I got first, so that's good. <laughs> What's up, Yoshino lover? It's good to see you, man. Sorry to hear you've been dealing with personal stuff, but good to see you back on stream. Thanks for chilling with me. So now we got a tie for first. So that means I have to either get first or second, and Koopa Troopa has to not get first or second, see? Okay. Definitely hold on to this. No, there's no explanation for him being that fast. Zero. There's no reason for that at all. He should have never caught up to me. Koopa's not that fast. What the? Wow, that's fair. That's totally fair. <laughs> Whoa, that was close. I had to jump out of the way of the freaking banana. I was going to get screwed. Oh, I got screwed again. Yep. He jumps over the banana, which you can't do. Oh, that was totally fair! Okay, now I have to maintain first or I'm fucked. He cheated! He cheated! He cheated! I'm done. I can't come back now. He completely cheated. There's nothing I can do about that. That's complete bullshit. I'm done. I lost again. Yeah, I lost because the game cheated. Wow, dude. What the hell? He cheated. 100%. Out of nowhere, gets an artificial speed boost, pushes me into the fucking lava? Go fuck yourself, dude. That's a complete cheating. So there's no way for me to win now. Even if I get first place, he's gonna get second and he's still gonna win. What's up, Joe? How's it going, man? Still no speed boost. Like I said, even if I get first, I can't win. He's gonna- Koopa will get second, and I'm gonna lose anyway on points. Which is fucking complete bullshit. All because the game cheats like crazy, dude. The only thing I can hope for is Koopa somehow gets fucked up and gets second. If that's the case, then- or excuse me, gets third. If that's the case, then I can win, but Koopa needs to get third. It's the only way I can win. Not looking likely. Bullshit. Bullshit. See, Koopa has great handling, but he can't maintain the speed. He jumped over his own shell! He jumped over his own fucking shell, which you can't do.
I need to find a way to wipe him out. I need an item or something to hit him and wipe him out. Well, I didn't even get an item now. Oh my god. It doesn't matter, it's just him and me. Look at where fucking Koopa is. Are you kidding me? And not Koopa, uh, Donkey Kong. There's no way. He wins no matter what on points. Even though I'm gonna get first, he wins on points. Because the game cheated in a fucking Bowser stage. Yep. So I win, but because I got screwed one stage, I have to do it again. It's so ridiculous. And this is only 100 CC. This is 150. This is 100. Captain came in, did 100 bit cheers. So today I told my bosses and managers to fuck off. They said, okay, come in for four, six. I don't even know what that means. Yep, so I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get screwed by one point. No, I got screwed by two. Yeah, that's bullshit. Oops. I wanted to see if I could skip this. I guess you can't. No, you can't. Uh. Oh yeah, Yoshino Lover. I, he's in pre-order Call of Duty. He's gonna try to play with me on release day. Dude, I guarantee you it won't work on release day. Call of Duty never works online on release day, ever. It always fucks up. I probably will do the story on release day. So I gotta do it again. As broken as this is, dude. It's so stupid. It's so broken. And this is not even the hardest one, I told you guys. Frustrating. You do nothing wrong, all of a sudden the computer gets an artificial speed boost, push you into the lava, and now you have no chance to come back. Gee, thanks. What a great game. <laughs> the shortcut's to the right over there, but I always forget how to, how to get to it. I gotta try to remember. I dropped the banana peel, he ignored it. It's right there in the water, I see it. I think this one, Donkey Kong's not gonna be top three. I think it's actually gonna be Peach. Yeah, Peach will be third. Which is very dangerous, because you hit a Peach Mushroom, you, you, you get shrunken. And now you're like super slow. For a long time, it's like a whole lap. Okay, this is this race I got in the bag. I always get first on this one easily. The fucking Bowser stage that screws me over. Okay. Ugh. <sighs> okay, we got two more ons. Goodbye. And don't ask to come back either, both of you. Seriously. You have to like I'm blind or something. <sighs> Oh, I see what you're saying, Yoshi. I love you. I'm gonna play the story while you're playing it. Probably the best course of action because I almost guarantee you the online will be unplayable at launch. So as you can see, I'm getting progressively better now. I haven't hit a single one of the off-roaded areas yet, which is why I'm so far in the lead. Oh, now I did because I had to dodge two freaking shells. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, whatever. I barely touched it. Game's full of shit. Oh my god! Alright, at least I got first. Fuck. Oh. Koopa is always on my ass. <laughs> It's Bowser stage that's gonna determine everything. It's Bowser stage for all the marbles. <laughs> this one again, it should be pretty easy, I think. I gotta remember the freaking speed boost timing. I still don't. I hit Koopa. So they hit the ice blocks, which is great. It gives me a clear way to go through here. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. Oh, it looks like. Of all people, Donkey Kong's on my ass. Which I don't understand because he wasn't even in the top three in the first race. Weird. Now Koopa's back to second. Wow, I got screwed. I did a tiny little skid and because of that I almost lost all speed. Okay. La 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 la. Okay. So we got two more. I have to do well on Bowser stage or I can't unlock the next one. <laughs> I have to do well on this Bowser stage. Not fucking fourth place is the game cheats. Ugh. <clears throat> Still didn't get it. I can't figure the speed boost out. Donkey Kong hit the banana peel. How does it keep speed catching up? It makes no sense. My driving speed is way faster than Koopa's, and he keeps catching up to me. And I'm not hitting walls or nothing. It's just complete bullshit. There we go. Every turn there, he gets faster than me. Makes no fucking sense at all. Almost got robbed. Now I did get robbed. Look at this! I can't beat him! Oh my god! Oh my god! 
They gave him a faster maximum driving speed than Yoshi. You can't do that. Koopa does not have the same speed as Yoshi. That was actually impossible. Blatant cheating. On a straightaway, I should have passed him. On a straightaway, I should have blown right by him. It's fucking complete bullshit. Hello, D-Town G07. How's it going? Okay. Now, if I get first, I obviously I win. I need first place. If I get second, then we tie, and I lose. Seriously, if I get second he, and Koopa gets first, we t No, wait a minute. No, that's true. I got first place three times, so no. As long as I get second, even if he gets first, I still win. But if I get lower than second, then I'm fucked. Jumped over his own shell, you saw that? Some nice early game cheating. Here we go, I'm on a straightaway and he's as fast as me. Completely impossible. Well, I had to go way wide to avoid his shell, so I lost my speed. He has, look at that, well, the truth of the matter is, Koopa has better handling than Yoshi. So that situation actually could have been realistic. Now, everyone else passing me is completely unrealistic. He drove through it. That definitely should have hit him. Why? Why? Makes no sense. Well, hits the wall. Red Shell hits the wall. So I can't get him. Are right, you fuckhead? Jumps over a banana peel. I can't stop him. I still win, though. I'm still gonna win, but it's bullshit. Oh, I can artificially jump over a banana peel. Fuck you. Fuck you. Alright, we're gonna unlock special cup. That's the good news. Okay, finally. Fuck. There we go. About fucking time. Great race. Okay, very nice. Okay. So, I think that's enough for our initial session of Mario Kart. I love the game. I'll keep playing it. It's very frustrating, but it's fun. Next time we play, we can do... Wait, what? I apparently picked two player. Oops. I apparently picked two player by accident. I did it again. Yes. So let's make a save state. And next time I play, we can actually do a special cup. Very nice.